Hey, what's going on everybody from Utah Area High School? I'm Richard Cameron and you're watching Hot Ones, the show with hot questions and even hotter wings. Today, I'm joined by Mr. Abatton. He teaches physics one and two, AP physics, and is a known aficionado of both hot wings and bad dad jokes. For this last one here. Okay. Um, we do a little bit of a bad dad joke challenge. Okay. Since you're very, very, very famous for your bad dad jokes okay. in class. So we have this last wing here. Okay. You have a list, I have a list. Mm -hmm. Run through them one at a time. If you laugh, you eat it. And we can add, if you'd like, put a little more on it right now, since you're feeling real confident about things. Let's see how bad the jokes are. <sighs> All right. You want me to go first? Yeah. Did you hear about Mr. Cup? No. It's too bad. His wife died. Now he's a solo cup. Uh, okay, that means I have to eat. Um, I don't know. Would you call that a lie? Corny. Corny? Yeah, but Corny? it's a reaction. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead, Mr. Batten. Okay. Bridger, you're a runner, right? I am. Did you ever hear the old adage that the person who runs in front of a car will eventually get tired? And the person who runs behind a car will get exhausted. Did you ever hear that? I, I know. That's, that's pretty good, Mr. Batten. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. What does a grizzly bear say when he calls customer service? If the grizzly bear can say anything he wants to. <laughs> Just bear with me. Yeah. Did you hear about the idiot that went bear hunting? No. Well, he was driving down a road and saw a sign along the road that said bear left. He turned around and went home. <laughs> All right, that was good. All right, just for you, Mr. Batten. Let's shake this up a little bit. Oh, I don't want to do this. Why do cows have hooves instead of feet? I don't know, Bridger, you tell me. Oh, that's a lot. It is. What are you wow. trying to do to yourself? Wow, that's, okay, that's too much. They lack toes. Ah, so they're lactose intolerant. Gotcha. Bridger. We'll keep on the idiot jokes here. You know how to really confuse an idiot? No. There's a couple of different ways. I'll tell you one way. All right. Put them in a round room. Tell them to stand in a corner. I don't even know what to do after this point. It's over. All right. What's the first thing? What's the first thing Santa's elves have to learn in school? Oh, shoot. I used the other hand. I don't know. Tell me. The alphabet. Oh, no. You ready for my next idiot joke? Sure. How do you keep an idiot busy for hours? Turn over for answer. How do you keep an idiot busy for hours? Turn over for answer. That is good, Mr. Batten. That is really good. Yep. And, um, wow. Are you, are you gonna eat that? Yeah. All right, this progressively gets worse. All right. All right. What do you call someone with no body and no nose? Nobody knows. All right. You got that one. Mm hmm Good job. Hey, I got something for you. Mm-hmm. Would a fly without wings be called a walk? No. They call a fly a fly. Well, if you take away his wings, would he be called a fly, a fly or a walk? Hmm. I don't know. What's Forrest Gump's <coughs> What's Forrest Gump's password? One Forrest one. All right, we're done. He's too good at these. Wait a minute, I got, I'm not done. We're done. I, I don't have anything else. That's that. You got me, Mr. Batten. You were the king of bad dad that jokes. Just, that just reminds me about that time I went to anger management classes. Why they made you me in so anger mad. management classes. They made me so mad I quit. You, you know what? Go ahead and finish these, because you were just, you were killing these. I, I don't even, we're just going to throw these away. We don't need them anymore. Short? Yeah. 
Is that chocolate milk or white milk? It's chocolate. Yeah, it's chocolate. Okay. Do I need more wings? No, you knocked those out of the park. Like, impressively. Okay. Do I need more jokes? I'm enjoying them. You're having a great time right now, and mm -hmm. I that kind of disturbs me. You know, like, I, you, Mr. Batten, you are a messed up man if you enjoy this. You know, I'm a physics teacher, right? Mm-hmm. I was reading this book about anti-gravity. <laughs> you know, I couldn't put it down. <laughs> Mr. Batten, I'm sorry, I'm not laughing like I would be if I was not having a terrible time right now. Ah. You know, I stayed up all night last night trying to figure out where the sun was. <laughs> then, Ooh, it dawned on, then it dawned on me. Oh, you want more? Would you Would you like a couple more wings? That's all right. I already drank my milk now. No, come here, man. Come here. Listen, we got we got a nice order in. Okay. Twist my arm. Okay. What do you do for fun? Like, is this is this enjoyable to you? I hate fun. Clearly. Maybe too much on that one. Mm. And this is, you know, this is like an afternoon snack or something. This is like this pretty is much. <sighs> Spread it around a little bit. You are blowing my mind right now. Oh. It's getting warm. Mm -hmm. My mind, man. Mr. Batten, mm -hmm. you have officially killed this challenge. Knocked it out of the park. I'm dying right now. You are comfortable and enjoying yourself. So this camera, that camera, or that camera. Let the kids know why they should continue with their academic careers. Why? Why? Well, so you could go on and be successful, of course. And so you don't get stuck with doing challenges like this. <laughs> get stuck at school doing challenges like yeah. this. Thank so you, Mr. Abad. Pursue the academics. Cheers. What's the one about the scarecrow? He's got an award for being outstanding in this field. Ooh, that's a good one. I don't know what to do with Is that, that the last yeah. wing? Just dip it in the salt, sir. Yeah, there's a little bit left. Don't work for that. Be careful here. Be careful. Oh, come on, Mr. Batten. You're better than that. Uh, now he's not. Now he's beating his feet. There you go. There you go. I'll double it for you. Thank you. I don't know how it's gonna go with the milk though. I'm not gonna spread it around with you. How's that? Vinegar is the first ingredient, so it's not that hot. See, memories get clouded over the years. I can't remember everything. Still running, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh boy. I can't remember what I did five minutes ago now. Yeah, mm-hmm. I guess I'll eat this before I ask the question for a dramatic effect. Yeah. <laughs> then, then dip it in there. You might as well just put it on your tongue if you're going to do I'm not there. Hungry. You can have uh, a yeah. double sided yeah. effect. Yeah, yeah. alright. Yeah. I'm just scared. Yeah. This is so much worse straight. <laughs> Never before have I eaten something like that straight. Oh, that is so... Oh, I feel like I can't even see you. <laughs> I gotta give you credit, you went back for more. I feel like, oh my gosh. <laughs> I give you credit. Drink some of the mild stuff. Oh yeah. Away. No, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I don't know if we're done filming or not, but I need to take a walk. <laughs> All right, Bridger, thank What's you. What's your secret, man? What's that? What's your secret? Out?
years of practice.